All right, so it's been a few days. I added another five layers of Spectra cloth. So it sits something like that. Like that. If you want to kill them, shoot them in the mouth. <laughs> Shut up. Uh, it pulled it apart, but it stopped it. Look at there. Wow. And 22. It's a hole. And nailed with another one. Right here was the. Get it from the back. So. And then from the top. Okay, 40. That was, that was like 50. You gave me 50 there. Don't even lie. I was giving you good punches, good hits. You're standing. Yeah. Oh no, random attacker. I don't see this coming. Sucker punch to the head. You knocked my head off. Which was recycling milk jugs into ballistic plates. Yeah. <laughs> Big old 44 Magnum. Whenever you're ready. And then four layers of Kevlar laminated with silly putty. Hi everyone, and welcome back to the channel. It is an actual functioning respirator attachment. Ah. Yeah, I'm ready. I stopped eight rounds from this 357 Magnum six inch barrel. So we're revisiting it. Right, but this time we're going to be using acrylic instead of glass so it holds together better, much like the pros do it. And I'm really excited to take this out and test it. Two, one. This Vulcan 166 polyurethane. Nice. All right, so here is the new one. This one actually performed closer to that metal one. All right, so the next day I let it cure overnight. This is kind of what we're dealing with here. See it dripping out. Then we also have the Taurus P101 uh, shooting 40 caliber rounds. We're outside, you can see how much more reflected it is in the natural sunlight. Just don't let it bounce. Alright, let's try the So we haven't stopped this one yet. But I have an idea on how we can. So let's get started. 